The unearthly cries of the undead fill the tomb. The dry the sapphire gate is shut. You will have to find a way to raise it. A plaque of Barn Dryden, first of the line of reach. Sapphire Gate is open. You hear scratching sounds from the central crypt like ragged nails. is open. The scratching sound grows louder, then turns into pounding. Something trapped inside a sarcophagus wants out. gate is shut. You will have to find a way to raise it. A plaque upon the floor reads, This sanctum in memory of Iso Dryden, Prioress, whose body was lost. You hear a clatter from the hallway. The topaz gate is raised.
on the floor reads Anselm Drive, Sword of the Light Undying. You hear a click from the direction of Gerard's tomb.
plaque up on the floor reads, Herein lies Lamprey Bright, Bishop and Defender of the Faith. A rusty metal. The direction of Gerard's stone tomb. gates enclosing Gerard's tomb grind open. Three sunstones are mounted above the gates to Gerard Dryden's tomb. The shadows within the tomb shift disturbingly. Sarcophagus shudders violently and explodes in a storm of jagged stone. A plaque on the floor reads, Gerard Bright, the Bishop, may the darkness live for the darkness. 